there's a scene where where Bilbo I think climbs all the way up to the top of the trees in this dark Mirkwood forest and you know it's just a whole other world of yeah. new species and light. What was your do you recall an early experience or your first experience of being actually on the forest yeah. canopy and what was that yeah. like? It was like it was exactly like Bilbo. It was like what? <laughs> because you know from the forest floor you're looking up at this invisible, yeah. basically invisible. You see the bottoms of the branches and then, and then you see some green stuff and then you see birds sort yeah. of flopping around. But when you're sitting up in the canopy on one of these large, beautiful, horizontal tropical tree branches that are covered with this upholstery of diverse orchids and ferns and bromeliads and piperaceae and, and then this underlying canopy soil underneath those plants you realize, my gosh, you know, and in the canopy soil are earthworms and larvae and beetles and mycorrhizae and fungi. And so what you're really seeing is this universe of arboreal life that is completely invisible to those who are walking on the forest floor. So I guess in terms of a sense of longing, when we climb into a tropical or temperate rainforest canopy, we satisfy a longing not only for self and connection, we're also, I think, satisfying this idea of curiosity, of discovery, of encountering a world that we did not, we were not aware of. 